Periods of illness can often give people with diabetes a bit of a shock. If your blood sugar raises without good reason and stays that way throughout the day, it might mean you've caught a cold or infection. The body reacts to infection by raising blood sugar levels, which can be problematic as well as a surprise for people with diabetes. It can be quite common for blood sugar to rise even before the symptoms of illness present themselves. If you have a blood glucose testing kit, you are advised to test your blood glucose more often than normal. Charity Diabetes UK recommends that people with type 1 diabetes test for ketones if the blood sugar level rises above 15 millimoles per litre, as this could indicate a dangerous condition called ketoacidosis is developing. It's recommended to drink fluids regularly when ill to keep yourself hydrated. If you take insulin, it's important that you keep taking that insulin when you're ill. Diabetes UK says that if you're having trouble keeping food down, you should replace meals with drinks with carbohydrate in them, such as milk or sugary drinks instead. This will ensure you're getting enough energy for your body. Some people will find they need to increase insulin levels when they're ill. If you're unsure about anything or struggling with your levels, contact a member of your healthcare team. If blood sugars get out of control and rise too high for too long, they can become dangerous. Laboured breathing, dehydration, vomiting and loss of consciousness are all signs of dangerously high blood sugar levels. If you experience any of these conditions, you should seek medical help immediately. As the illness passes, you should find your levels return back to normal. If you increased your insulin during the illness, you may find you start to get low levels or hypos, so be ready to change your doses back to what they were before the illness.